Okay, magnets, magnets over here. Magnets. Further that, increase all hero damage by by an additional one. Yeah, that'll that'll be good. Got to do what brings you joy. Exactly. All right. I keep reading magic mine as magic mime, and I'm like, yeah, why not? And then I have to like mentally correct and say, no, that's wrong. Oh, I have no idea why, but I just had the like most intense urge to play uh, Lord of the Rings The Two Towers on PS2. It's really silly. Because I've never played it. I played Return to the King with my brother, but I, I never actually played... Grab Tangled Vines. I never actually played uh, Two Towers. Kind of wish I had. That was a fun game. At least from what little I saw of it. Uh, what do we want our last one to be? Orbital Fire? Yeah. Seems reasonably good. The main problem is just getting harassed by bees. This dude didn't re re uh, read it as Magic Mike. Hey, no judgment. I know when that... Uh, that came out in theaters. I knew quite a number of people that were very excited to see it. And I did not find out what it was about until like 10 years later when I looked it up. And I'm like, oh yeah, what is Magic Mike about? Oh, that's what it's about. Oh, please tell me. Yes! Got the urge to watch Labyrinth. Labyrinth's kind of fun. I'm just gonna up the flat damage on on this. Come on, come on, landmines! Keep the bees off of me. You have one job. Oh shit! Okay, never mind. This ain't working. Yeah, that, uh, that vacuum range goes far? Oh, very welcome. And we just killed that guy somehow. I don't question these things. They just happen and I'm happy about it. Uh, ha. Okay, increase attack size, nah. I, I kind of I kind of want to just focus pure speed on this one rather than size so it can hopefully keep enemies off of my face at least we have plenty of healing kind of not much for aoe here though which is kind of rough oh but there's another pet uh, is that worth engaging with yeah pretty much always I'm gonna get inundated in bees though. There's a lot of bees here. And bee spawners. You know what else was like really big back in the day when it was just coming out? I dating myself age wise, but I remember when like Justin Bieber was the thing for like it was like seven years running. It was wild. And then I have not heard like anything about him in ages, except for the fact that maybe he fought somebody. And that was about it. It's weird. I I think it's actually probably a little bit more common um, than I make it out to be for like major, major whatever sensations to become complete and total nobodies. Oh, well, this is this is a pickle. And it's actually pretty rare for famous famous folks that aren't actors who are constantly refreshed. It's quite rare for these folks to remain in, in the spotlight for longer than their 15 minutes of fame or maybe, you know, year and a half. Year and a half of fame? It varies on a... 
on a person-to-person -person basis. Wow, that's a lot of worm. Keep reducing the cooldown on those mines. I'm not dead yet. In fact, I'm shockingly hardy. There we go. Okay, extra magnet range. That's gonna go equally far. Oh, I wanted all of those. That's nah, fine. Okay, we got another boss and I'm sure we're going to get even like so many more. Ah! I wanna have the landmines have a really, really short cooldown. If I can. There we go. Get blasted, son. Nano Machines, sir. I really need to play that. I know Mini Murgle. You said, oh gosh, I'm now dying. I know Mini Murgle, you sent that my direction, and I've been meaning to load it up, but it is. What the hell? What? What? I'm dying. It's like M. Bison. But considerably more fatal. I just can't get through this. Nope. Damn. Oh. Well, did we get enough resources? Probably not. That's 80. Ugh. Hmm. We definitely have the HP there. Try something completely random. It's probably not actually that good. But three tornado. And then as many tornado as we can tornado. As if I have no choice, we should grab cleave. Oh, well, this is handy. Because unupgraded cleave with a ton of AoE uh, can still cut through most of the skele boners, which is rather helpful. Okay. Increase number. Scoot pass. Shit hurts. Okay. Increase damage further. Decrease cooldown of spear. Get absolutely mobbed by tornadoes. Somehow not die. And we're good. Ah, the dev left? Alright. Let's see. Grab this. All in on tornado will carry you. It's just the main thing is lasting long enough for it to actually uh, crystallize into something amazing. I've I've had pretty random luck on all in on tornado. Okay. 
Ooh. Got another one of these. Ow. I just don't... I don't think this is going to be the character to do it. I, I think... I think we probably want to be the EXP character going all in on Tornado. Oh, who knows? I might get very lucky here. Come on. Don't fail me now. Walked right into it. Ouch. Yeah, this character just dies too damn fast. Alright, start run. I want to get like one more win in. The problem is, I keep scaling the difficulty on myself to <clears throat> improve faster. And it's, uh, it's only working okay. Okay, increase number. Magic mine. Increase attack size. If I see tornado, I pick tornado. If I don't see tornado, tangle vine. If I don't see tornado, I get confused. I don't know what to do. All in on orbital. I've done that. It's not good. Please don't suggest it. It works really well on like two maps and it's absolute hot trash here. But also, I don't know. I'm not super interested in recommendations. Uh, no spear, grab cleave? Okay, big thing is we got to go find a critter, probably. There it is. That is weirdly convenient. So we want melee range and tornado. Those are the two. Okay, further attack size. Magnet range. Honestly, maybe the health would have been better, but this way I level faster. Okay. Grab some of these. Okay, attack size or cooldown rate? Probably cooldown rate more than anything else here. Uh, it's probably reset. It sucks. Yeah, in retrospect, Hardy might have been the better, better start. Okay. Doing it. Okay. Didn't get what I was going for, but I'll take what I got. And then probably bail because bees. Grab it all, AoE size, nah. Do landmine damage. Doesn't need to, need to be much, it just needs to be there. I could really use a heart, yes. I could really use quite a number, really. Oh, there's some money. I swear I saw a chest somewhere. Ooh. Bad place to 
to B. Okay, further attack size increase. Okay, an increase in number. Did not push them enough. Oh, well, there's a heart and another merchant tent, which is actually kind of good. Okay, 250. It ain't much, but maybe it'll net me some souls. I'll take it. Because I don't have much of a choice. We're not doing strictly terrible, but I definitely need more tornado cooldown. Yeesh. Instead, we're getting a lot of tornado attack size, which I guess is kind of good. Landmine cooldown, tornado attack size. Uh, I'll take whatever. Ow. Dig for loot every 10 seconds. some tornado damage if I can. I haven't invested too much into it. Ow, ow, ow. Major risk for going tornadoes. Okay, here we go. Cha uh, get rid of avoid the chaser. Nope. Do what I can. Keep grabbing these. I'm just gonna speed mode for gold. Ain't much. But at least it's something. Increased number. Yeah. Oh, this is heck. I'll take it all. Wait for the next tornado group. <laughs> okay. We've got the uh, tornado cooldown that we pretty much can have a tornado salvo going nonstop. 380. Get the hearts. Okay. Wish these had a little bit more knockback to them. But I don't have too much of a choice. Okay. Getting some HP. Increase attack size. No. I'll go back for the boxes. Go back for the boxes. Thank you. Okay. Cooldown rate. I'm getting hemmed in a little. I'm getting hemmed in a fair bit. But I'm getting a lot of EXP for it. Yeesh. And I actually had the HP to spare. Which is kind of unusual in this state. Ow. Now let's keep pushing the damage. I can make them bigger and bigger, but at this point we needed to actually start chewing through some things. Number would go far too, but I don't have too much of a choice. Yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna largely try and hang out inside inside my tornadoes. There's a lot of mid-boss. Okay, uh... Hmm. Do we want even more magnet range, or no? We want a semi-reliable source of hearts. Getting that is 
massive survivability bonus. And I'm gonna get more magnet range, I'm sure. Ow. Not that ow, but ow. Okay. I am just going to uh, keep decreasing the cooldown. What is the minimum cooldown? Okay, so we can reduce it down to, I think, 1.8. There we go. So we can pretty much just get rid of these guys. So let's keep increasing that size, too. If these tornadoes are not giga huge, I'm not doing it right. There's damage. Damage the landmines. Still got a couple more bosses, including Dapper Worm. Armor Worm, Dapper Worm. And, like, many, uh, many, great many goons in between. Okay. Now, who are you getting heals on this class? Drops from enemies? Uh, no. So, uh, I'm getting heals mostly as a result of one of the pets that you unlock. There's one that gives you, gosh, um, uh, there's one that has a 25% chance every 10 seconds to give you a heart drop. Plus, I'm also kind of rushing for as many crates as I can possibly see. I don't know what I'm unlocking. I don't think I am for the moment. I don't think I can. Oh, I see. Chests. Oh, that magnet range, though. Ooh, this area is actually, like, hyper lucrative. Okay, so that should be the last of the cooldown reduction that I can grab. Here we go. Please bring me the other direction. Okay, cooldown rate on this. Well, there's the next boss down. Okay, big worm. Now I should have gotten more on the tornado, maybe. Yeah, I've still got five minutes left. What are we doing on magic mine cooldown? Pretty much bare minimum that I can possibly get here. Whoop. Okay. I just want to head for that other set of things. There's no easy way for me to directly aim where I'm going, though. Makes it a little, little tougher. Oh, oh, there was a boss. I was about ready to panic and run away from him, and then he just freaking died. How are we doing on resources? Pretty good. I was hoping for a smidge more, to be honest, but I'll take whatever I can get. Okay. Nope. Wrong direction. I need my EXP over here. So I guess now there's a supply of EXP on the other side. I don't know. This whole everything is silly. I'm a little disappointed to know that you uh, you cap out at 10 upgrades per weapon. Because it would be really fun if you could actually have tornadoes so big that they uh, they encircle you completely. I would feel so cozy in that in that moment. Yeah, at this point I'm feeling a lot better. The tornadoes have such huge coverage. The only immediate problem is their damage is not as good as like certain other 
uh, certain other weapons, but I don't know, even then. Okay, let's just grab it all. See if I can get down here where I can surround and pummel this schmuck. Let's see. In retrospect, maybe landmine AoE size isn't that great. I might want to focus on, like, AoE damage over time. But I mostly want to just go with the biggest damn tornadoes that you can possibly tornado. Twelve tornadoes. How much? Okay, so at this point, it's almost capped out. It's just damage for tornadoes. This is actually pretty dang good. Because, yeah, they do hit enemies multiple times. And I'm effectively surrounded in a circle of tornado at all times. But the circle's made out of hemispheres. Unfortunately, there's a couple of enemies that are still getting through. But it's becoming less and less. Yeah, I think I'll want the magnet range again, if I can get it. As silly as it sounds, there's a fair bit still lightly outside of my range. The one problem is, as I make these tornadoes bigger, more EXP just ends up off screen for me. Let's see. Increase AoE size, though I probably should not be investing too much in that. I don't think we need AoE size so much as just pure raw damage. And I think the damage over time is going to be that. I don't know if it stacks. But I'd like to imagine that it does. I actually took some damage there. Dude, Jesus, those are big. This is maximum tornado. It cannot get bigger. Uh, let's see here. My mind's cooldown reduction is maxed. Really do not like the fact that the mud men spawn underneath me. Because I cannot tell. It would be lovely. Lovely to see. But yeah, they just kind of get swept in. Luckily, Hardy is, is keeping me up pretty effectively, so I don't need to worry about it. Yeah, Conrad can make it bigger. This is true. But everything's bigger with Conrad. If it isn't, you're probably not actually playing with Conrad. Or you've picked a weak choice. We don't pick weak choices here. We go big. We only go big. There's no option to go home. Alright. I would look in. Well. Comfortable spot. I've got a minute. I'm gonna keep investing in the damage over time. On those mines. I figure whatever the boss is, if I can cook it. That'll do the trick. I'd like to find a merchant, but at this point I'm not betting on it. I can't really move that fast. I almost wish there were map markers, like, hey, by the way, there's a merchant over here. That would actually be kind of grand. Okay, let's keep pushing, keep pushing the damage over time. Keep pushing the chest. Cause I need, I need 60 of those to get what I'm looking for. 
There we go. Ki kinda. Whew. This is gonna take a while. Actually, no. It's boss time. Alright. Holy smokes, it's got 2,500 HP. That's an issue. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. Purple bugs that I can't see at all well. Yep. Can barely tell where they are. Ow, boss hurts. This is an issue. <laughs> Got it. We live. We get resources. That is tough. But we got it. Okay. Only 280? Nope, never mind. There's the multiplier. That's what I was looking for. Oh. Okay. Let's grab that and grab this. We now have the spine dunes. Well, I guess we do another. Coins are worth 50% more. Crystals are worth plus one. Oh, but it's also a pet. They're all pets. I'm not against the pets, but I'm not enthused by them. And we still haven't even fought spirit twisters. I haven't fought enough of those eye demons. There's a number of these enemies that I just am starting to wonder if they're... If they are... Oh, chest will open even faster. Hmm. Hmm. Increase all hero loot magnet reach by an additional 20%. More mining nodes can appear on the battlefield. I'm going to go for the chest open even faster. What is this? Orbital fire. More abilities. More chests. More crit chance. A lot of this. The crystal pet pet is actually super good because you can get more. You know what? That's a good point. That is a good point. Ugh. Nah, no. Let's try something weird. What? Wait, what? Do we not have? Oh, Desert Battle Spine Dunes. I see. Spine Dunes, you say? Second location in the desert. Wow. Hopefully that means they plan on having a lot of... Uh, I'm hoping they're planning on having a lot of these then. This is awkward. Here we go. Uh, uh, too much tornado. Grab an orbital fire in the magic mine. I'm looking forward to when uh, some of these get buffs. Especially the Grand Hex, because I feel like you could do some really fun things with it, but... In the meantime, I don't know. I'm trapped. So this area uses a lot of the same level design conventions as the forest. A lot of hard barriers that actually are kind of hard to pass. Okay. Also, I'm quite surrounded by this point. See if I can kind of punch my way out. Unfortunately, for how fast this character is, she is very easily surrounded. And then it doesn't matter how fast you are, you are 
Not a good spot in that case. That's okay. I'm getting real sleepy. I think I want to try something else. I... I will say, I'm having a blast with this game. Oh, and there's the... There's the shurikens. I've heard iffy things about the shurikens. Unfortunately. I don't actually know if they're up to snuff. But who knows, maybe they're actually really good. Okay, grab all the EXP before we go too far. More magic mines. Shurikens are the best single tar target DPS. Makes sense. I guess it's still kind of rare for me to need single target DPS in this game. Whew. Yeah, the lack of healing on her is not great for how much damage she takes. Oh, increase damage, increase AoE. Let's just do damage. I would like to escape from here. Please. I'm dead. Well, it's fine. Yeah, we'll come back we'll come back to this region, I think, when I've got my head back on straight. I'm just a little sleepy, and so I don't think I'm going to engage with it properly. Uh for now though. I just look around. I'm I'm making some major progress, and once we can start clearing like hard mode really quickly. And once we have all these like things that make opening chests really fast. Oh boy, that's gonna get that's gonna get wild. What is this one again? Ooh. Blue souls are worth more EXP. Oh, but it's another pet. I'm I'm always torn on the pets. They're good, don't get me wrong. But I'm still always torn on them. Yeah, because I can't get these. Yeah, EXP pet is good too. Yeah, I can imagine. Oh, Tangle Vine size banner. Increased. These are interesting. Yeah, so one of the other things that I'm I'm starting to notice is that like half of these are kind of mediocre, partly because I haven't finished their meta progression either. The next magnet is gonna be good. Yeah, where was that again? It was here. 400 though, that's gonna take a while. So yeah, I guess we do need the crystal pet to properly unlock it. Well, I think we'll leave that for tomorrow.